but it does stem from, I mean, I, I have the, the background and upbringing that a lot of us, unfortunately, a lot of us young black men have. I share that in terms of a lot going on at home. You know, I come from a family of drug use, the hood and all that stuff, you know? Um, and for me, so seeing that at a young age, I kind of just learned, I saw that side. I didn't want to be that. I knew that. But also I was blessed enough to be in an area where I also saw the other side of the fence. You know, I saw family. I saw community. I saw people coming together, help each other. And I just gravitated naturally towards that. You know, so I kind of was put, I pushed myself away from the negative. And then, you know, so over there you got to see. And I, I just, for me, it started with family. And I said, I, I vowed that I didn't want the next generation coming up to kind of grow up like we did. To have to see the things that we saw and experience some of those things. And I'm not saying it was the worst in the world, but I found that everybody's situation, your experience, your trauma is relative to 